Howdy folks, Richard Johnson here, and welcome to the new update to 1.37, 1.37, 0.35, 0.38. Yeah, who cares? I don't. Well, yeah, actually, I do, but never mind. <laughs> uh, many of you maybe have uh, played the game already because the uh, patch has been out for a little while. Yeah, I'm a little bit late due to I have uh, been uh, changing uh, apartments and so on, and now I have. Uh, moved out from my uh, apartment where I lived before and uh, am now stationed at home with ye, go wi with ye good old parents. <laughs> so if you hear some clanking or swearing in the background, that's my parents. But never mind. They are friendly. I told them not to bite anyone. Uh, yeah, 1.37 or 1.37. Yeah, 1.37. It's an ex 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 extremely big new patch for the entire system because they've changed so much and uh, they've changed the way of how you uh, research planes and uh, items or equipment, how you can call it, and uh, the new layout and so on, and how you advance. But uh, I'm just gonna go through some quick uh, things and then I will. I can leave a description in the uh, description box below a link to their own web page and to uh, Bohemian Eagle or the Mighty Jingles, his own surviving the 1.37 patch. It's a really good video, and uh, I learned some more there than I learned from uh, War Guy Jeans or War Thunder's own page. But yeah, let's see here. Okay, cross that down. Right, this is the new layout. Instead of 20 different tiers, you have 5 different levels of tiers. And this is my German tech tree, because yeah, I played Germans the most, so it's, it's more things to see here. Uh, all the planes that I've researched are displayed like this, and the ones I've researched but not bought are displayed like that. You can see the amount of money it costs to buy it, but it's blue like I've researched it. And I can't research that one because I haven't bought the previous one. Uh, the flashing yellowing or orange here. Yeah, I can tell you to research a plane. Uh, it's not anymore like you can't level up in a certain uh, nations. Okay, so certain nation like. Before this one, I was I was level uh, is it eleven or le level twelve in the Germans, but now yeah, it's only up to a level five of planes. But the nation tier, it if you look down here to the left, there ain't no like tier for the nation. It used to say like tier five, and you are that much bo uh, XP out of that much. But now it is like this. Right. Uh, let's say, say I, d I haven't uh, researched all these other planes. I re re recently bought and researched this one, the E3, and I want to get the next plane, the F1, which is flashing here. And then all I have to do is press research on the button here, that button on this plane. But now it says convert. But if it w uh, yeah. All I have to do is press research and it was will load a little bit and then bam, that plane will be like researching f for its own, on its own, without you having to do anything. Uh, because after every battle you will earn, le let's say you earn 10,000 equipment or modules, modules XP. Because listen now, there are two different uh, XP. There are module XP and there are planes XP or vehicles XP. Module XP's are the ones that you're using on the planes. Uh, let's see here, like this one. This is the plane that I have now. You can see that on underneath the name you can see that I have 1100, the cost is 1100 XP or required RP. RP is research points. So you have it. It costs 1100 research points. And this one also. So everyone here at tier one costs 1100 RP. I'm getting th to think of League of Legends and riot points. Uh, I can choose 
well, whichever one of these I want to research first. So like it isn't like in the old times where this cost 50, then 1100, 1300, 21,000 like and you maybe got compressor before you got, got that one and so on. So all you have to do now is I uh, let's say I want to research that one. Press that button and it's it says modification research research started. Now, after every battle that you fly in this plane, you will earn a certain amount of XP. Let's say 10,000 XP. And now 10,000 of that total XP, let's say 8,000 of those are research XP. Or uh, research points, yeah. Mo let's say modules XP. Uh, so 8,000 modules XP that lets you actually buy one, two, three, four all these after one battle, and you will ha still have enough research XP or modules XP. Sorry for that, modules XP to maybe continue with this one. It costs 1700, and this one costs 1700, and this one costs 1700. So uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. 6,000, yeah, let's say we have enough to buy all, to even to even to the airframe. But uh, maybe I want to buy like fuselage, radiator, and yeah, maybe then I will go to new 77mm machine guns and that bomb load. Because you only have to choose two, I only have to get two of these, then I can get two of those, and then I can get two of those before I can get one of these. It it gets easier after we play the battle, and yeah, uh, like I said, it, there are two different kinds of XP. Modules XP that are the XP that you earn after battle with that plane you fly flying, flying. If you fly the BF 109 G2 Trop, and I earn 8,000 module XP, that I can spend all that XP on every uh, modules that I have on that plane starting from the top like tier 1 tier 2 and uh, when when I don't have enough XP for the next module like say I, I spend all my module XP I don't have enough to buy this after about the radiator and the ETC 50 build tier 8 D something like that uh, I just press research and if I, s if I have 500 module XP 500 of module XP will like position itself on that bar and until and like stay there so after the next battle if I earn 600 XP a module XP that one will be researched and you can buy it and then you'd say which one will you start researching next so after each battle you need to check like it will come up a, b uh, a square b uh, a box on the game HUD uh, by itself but uh, it says like it says this one is done researching. Would you like to buy it? You like press, yeah, press buy, and then 2,000 uh, lions, yeah, bought. Now, which one would you like to research next? And then you choose one. It's like okay, done, there, out of the question. Sometimes, if you like research a new plane, like I have here, this one BF109 F1, it is in research, and uh, you can see that underneath the big picture it says O out of 22,000 so I need 22,000 XP um, or like vehicle XP to research that plane and th you earn different amounts of XP with different amount of planes you fly like if you hold the mouse here it says this is it is the most effective at researching vehicles of tier 3 to 5 ranks and since that BF 109 F1 is a res uh, rank 2 plane this one won't earn a, uh, a really good amount of XP to research that plane because it has tier 3 to 5 but if I fly my uh, this one the BF 109 F4 TROP which uh, I have like maxed uh, it says it's it is the most effective at researching vehicles of one to five, four ranks, so that means that when I fly this plane, I will earn a lot of vehicles XP, and vehicles XP are in every plane that I fly. If I fly every plane that I have here in my loadout, 
and after the battle is done, every, I may, everyone is. Uh, I I died in everyone except the last one, and then the battle is d done, and all the vehicles XP that I have earned on every one of these will I gather to to get it and become one huge amount of vehicle XP, and all those vehicle XPs will be direct sum, su di directly summoned towards this plane that I have in the research. So I have to, you all have to check these out before you uh, start the battle. Like maybe you want to like to research this uh, Focke Wolf 98 F8, but uh, you forgot to change it. Well, tough luck. Next time, maybe you uh, research 1800 or 18,000 or so uh, during a flight in this plane and when you when you press di to start researching this plane next time the 18,000 XP will stay here and it will say none out of 100,000 so yeah it says the required RP 100,000 and uh, yeah let's pretend it it's like this way I fly a battle I earn 500 vehicle XP because uh, yeah it was a shit game and vehicles XP are actually not earned uh, as fast as modular XP's, but screw that now. I earn 500, and uh, after battle I noticed, shit, I wanted to research this one, the Focke Wolf 190F8. I press this one, and then research, but I can't do it now because I haven't bothered to screw it. I press research, and then it says, new plane type, start research started, like so. And then we can see that this one says it is n not out of 100,000. But I'm like, wait, I, I earned 500 vehicle XP, but yeah, after the battle is done and so on, it's like, it stay there, you can't do anything to it with it, it, it's locked in that vehicle. But if you say, alright, let's continue s researching the BF109 F1, all of a sudden you still have those 500 XP, vehicle XP, so it stays there. So you have to check out your loadout in every plane and so on before you start the battle. Uh, most, the most important thing may be most important things maybe like planes and so on uh, so yeah I want to check this plane I want to have the offensive seven millimeters this plane is yeah offensive 20 millimeters after that one I can choose the next one I need 2000 and I believe that I will earn it in this battle so yeah I set up a tier 3 type of planes so uh, press arcade bell to hit the road and uh, let's see here now they changed a little bit of the looks and so on like you can see very much further away I need to lower the sound Facing HE 101H6, uh, Spitfires Mark 9, P400, J J Jack 9K, Beaufort, uh, P40, Kitty Hawks, IL Force, Pershka, everything. So it's a big mashup now because earlier this plane was rank, uh, what was it, uh, 10, and I have. A bar and I have a bombers that are ra maybe rank, rank eight, but now they have like smashed all them together. Oh shit! <laughs> uh. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> the 
that was uh, bad of me. I didn't actually notice how low I was. Excellent. The fog is really low. My altitude is only 3k kilometers. Now, let's fight above the clouds. <laughs> right, this is the 50 millimeter cannon. 21 rounds. Yeah, I had to change this plane due to the other one that I had. It's a tier 4. Let's see if we can help out our friend in need. Yeah, and this is new also. Let's see. Answer 4. Yes. Before it you had to press like T4 to get help. Now it is really hard. I need to catch up to him. Those BF-109s shoots Gigatron. Let's see, Giga F4 shoots, uh, where is he? The F4 drop. Let's see if I can, I can catch up to him. Well, at this rate, rate I won't earn a huge amount of XP. They are actually out running. <laughs> this will take a while. They have added uh, quite a few. Uh, uh, they added some planes, uh, changed the lookouts and the damage modules for someone. Planes and uh, check out the link in the description below. You will actually. Oh, wrong button. Forgot which button it was to press the cannon. And yeah, like, like I said, check uh, the d link in the description below to uh, read some of the new updates. It is extremely lot to take in, like so. So maybe it's not the best weapon loader to dogfight with a BF-109. have cannons on this plane but it is the same button that I fires my 50 millimeter not catching up. In fact he's crashing. Or no? No it's not. Let's see here. Nope. Died. Cannons that are 50 millimeters and cannons that are 20 millimeters. Not the best situation to have them both on the same button. <laughs> I thought that I only uh, this was the plane that only had a uh, 50mm. No, it's not. Can reload them. Wait, maybe it all goes e either way uh, underneath the same like type. I need to get, get some XP uh, out of this battle. 
so I can actually use it to show you guys guys and girls uh, the difference that cannon five seconds three unleash hell Someone else got them. Let's see if we can get some ground kills. We need XP. Now I have bad internet connection. Indeed, I have. Visual upgrades are extremely sexy. Got him off his. I got him in off his wing. Now let's see here. The fuck wolf. I need to upgrade a little bit more. And that was a uh, retard in the background. You heard. Who don't understand the meaning of what I do? Who think it's all jirish and sh stupid? But hey, he's old, so he hasn't much to say. See here now. Which button was it that I shot my rockets with? You need to level out. There is. at least internet fuck you yes I got him what <laughs> oh, who did I kill that internet yeah moving home to the folks, not going to be the best idea that I've ever made, but yeah, didn't have any options, no choice. 
don't understand what the button to the top left is actually indicating. I know that FPS is like yeah frames per second, but MS twenty eight point four twenty nine point four. It, yeah, it doesn't. Is it? No, it can't be twenty eight MS. It must be like two hundred and eighty six or something like that. That's why I don't like that everyone is so low when they're fighting. Because when you are losing like connection, you are dropping altitude really fast, like you're lagging down towards the ground. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, turn! Internet! <laughs> yep! It's bad! tail really gonna ram me even when I have bad internet Piece of shit. Wasn't even worth it. Right, this battle is taking on forever. Piece of shit. There, he got. the uh, air targets, right, can't hit ships with that Turn around, turn around, or is it turn away? Don't go away. Yes, I only had that opt opportunity. Let's see, attack seventy, no sixty. T-16, attack, ground units. Light pillbox, artillery, who nice.
scheme. my bomber I can't change my payload shit where's that ship light pillbox no he's down where is the last target oh oh we're done now <laughs> didn't notice. Now let's see here the interesting part. If we manage to have done so yeah we must have 5100. <sighs> right, earn 202 two but all modifications are research. Damn. On that plane yeah here you can see the research unit in that nation and that is the BF 109F F1 and I have increased 4588 huh. uh, da, da, da. and now let's see total modif modifications research that is all 5108 research points for the modifications and 1147 is vehicle research. Oh, I need to read this. And what does it say? Research efficiency depends on difficult level and rank difference. Also, by researching the next aircraft in range, the previous one received bonus research points. Oh wait, I have I have already researched some of that plane. So uh, you can see that the yellow part is the one that I got from this battle, and the or like darker uh, yellow or orange part is part is uh, the ones that I have already researched on that plane. Like you can see how, like you can see, like you can see how on the Measure Smith 410A1U4, I have gained plus 416 you can see that on uh, to the right research point 664 out of 2000 plus 416 uh, does it say anything here no it doesn't say how much we went plus I believe it is 1147 yeah that's again 322 from the um, ME410 374 from the other ME410 and 181 from the fucker wolf. And uh, the other ME410 we have increased 358 XP and the fucker wolf only 201. The bomber we hadn't, I uh, didn't gain the time to do anything. Missions 1, 225. Yeah, it was a really bad game, but. Internet is fucking towards me also, and this is free re right right research point. These are the ones up here. I have now five hundred fifty four thousand seven hundred eighty three five hundred fifty five k, and these are can you spend on the planes that you have uh, marked as your research plane? Yeah, uh, now due to I have like pressed out. Mark then nation uh, Germany. You can see the plane from the German tech tree, and I can do like that and maximum. I have no idea why it won't work. Screw it. 
let's do it like that. If I spend 300 and three, my, all my 300 eagles, I will get plus 11,972 XP on that plane. So uh, out of 554,000, I will spend 12,000 because I, yeah, I don't have any more eagles. I don't spend gold on this plane. Then you can press convert, and you will be done. If you have enough golden eagles, you can spend enough research research point to research the entire plane it, and it says uh, you have researched this plane done you can now buy it and then it will I believe it will it will automatically choose the next plane but you can still change it, change it if you want to like the German uh, Americans here they have chose the P400 for me to uh, automatically research but I can, uh, if I want to, mark the B25J1 Mitchell, and I'm actually going to choose that one instead. Research, and yeah, now it is marked as in research. I have played one battle with Americans now after the patch update, so I've sp gained 825 XP on the B25J Mitchell. Uh, so yeah, that are like the updates that I can tell you for now. I'm not so familiar familiar with uh, all these new up uh, update features and so on. Uh, Lieutenant, possibly a new feature that you gain like a rank or a name for your ranks. Uh, Events that changed it to a realistic and simulator. I believe simulator is full real battle, or that is maybe a historical. I, I have no idea. <laughs> realistic simulator, yes, yeah, arcade, historical, and full real battles. Historical, known as historic, earlier as historical. So they changed the names and so on, and uh, maybe they changed uh, how you can customize the planes, but more on that some other time. But yeah, till next time, take care of it. Uh, like a favor if you enjoyed it, subscribe to Join Army today, and uh, why not even favorite it? Uh, but yeah, do check out the information box below where I will link you to War Thunder's own update page and uh, there will there will have like a forum link and I will link you to uh, Mighty the Mighty Jingles video of the 1.37 update. He uh, knows a little bit more about the whole update than I do, even though he might s tell you some wrong things. But don't blame me, blame him. <laughs> uh, but yeah, till next video. Take care of each other now. And by the way, Merry Christmas, folks. It's a Happy joyful holiday out there now to celebrate, so don't spend too much time in front of the computer, spend it with your families and loved ears. Oh, I do sound jolly sometimes. <laughs> but yeah, till that time, take care of each other now. Merry Christmas.